Hi, today we're going to take a look at angle measures. Now I have this figure here. Um, first thing to know is whenever you see a picture, it is always assumed that it's not drawn to scale unless otherwise anything states. We have to go with what our descriptions tell us to be true. So we have a picture here. All I know so far is FA, ray a, FA, and ray FE, FA, FE are opposite rays. One goes that way, one goes that way. When they're opposite, that means they form a straight line. Okay. FB bisects AFC. FB bisects AFC. When you have something that bisects, bi means two. It cuts that angle into two equal parts. So I know that that and that have the same value. Okay. That's for the picture. Now going to the problem, we have, we're given some information and we need to find something. We know that AFC, AFC, this big angle is 8x minus 6. We also know that AFB inside that is 3x plus 10. So because we have a bisector, both of these have the same value. So if I know that this is 3x plus 10, that side's also got to be 3x plus 10. So we label it the same. Um, when we're dealing with angles, I have a small angle and a small angle, both within inside the large angle, add these up to equal that. So let's create an algebra problem. We're going to say 3x plus 10 plus 3x plus 10 equals 8x minus 6. You could also do 3x plus 10 parentheses around that whole group times 2. Same thing. Um, let's combine like terms. 3x and 3x gives us 6x. 10 and 10 is 20. Now we need to do a series of inverse operations and get x all by itself. So we can say minus 8x, leaving us with negative 2x minus 20 minus 20 equals negative 26 divide by negative 2 x equals 13. great we think we want to stop but that's not exactly what we're looking for we're looking for what the measure of the angle afc i want to know what does this whole thing actually equal so i need to take this 13 and put it in that value of x so now we get 8 times 13 minus 6. So 8 times 13 is going to give us 104. We subtract 6, and we're left with 98. So the measure of angle AFC is 98 degrees. And that's finding angle measures.